What is going on guys? Wiser here bringing you the recap of the last war for 2.0. Uh, it was against this Sand City Russian clan. They only used like half their attacks. Wasn't a very interesting war. Uh, did not put up much adversity for us. Uh, final score 41 to 27. Uh, as you can see level 7 clan. Um, they did have a quite the town hall 10 or no maybe it was even. That was the last war I'm thinking of. Um, they just really didn't didn't give <laughs> give it. There's still 12 attacks remaining, as you can see. Um, you know, 136 wins. We were hoping for a bit bit better of a, a fight here, but unfortunately, did not really get it. Uh, just gonna jump in and show a few of these replays. It was a smaller war, as you can see. We missed one of the nines there, but it was only a 15 person war. We had some guys over in Invicta and so on, uh, doing some other stuff uh, for this war. So it was a smaller one. Uh, we did miss one uh, on Matt. And like I said, one of the nine. So let's just jump right in here. I got a few really sweet attacks. I like JJ's hit on their top nine here. Um, sorry, I got some stuff going on in the background too, so it's lagging just a little bit. Um, but the video sh itself should be fine. Uh, so JJ's going to go ahead and bring basically a straight up max attack. Uh, two golems kind of going in uh, at this nine o'clock position. Uh, drops one on the Tesla, a couple whiz, another one going down, and he's going to drop a couple more whiz. Keep creating that funnel. As long as that army camp goes down, in go the wall breaker is going to open up that wall, no problem. So this huge section is now open from this earthquake he brought. Exposes the three air defense and the defensive queen. Uh, going to get really good push from those level 30 heroes going in here. It's about to drop a rage. Out comes a P.E.K.K.A. that could always be uh, a raid breaker for you. If the P.E.K.K.A. happens to lock on to your king or your queen, Queen, you're in big trouble if you don't get it down quickly and even the P.E.K.K.A. locking onto your golem it can you know in a few shots it takes down a golem so it only got one swipe off under that poison so that's good uh, King's in there doing his job defensive Queen is down uh, they're working on that defensive King and both those air defenses are getting taken down so now he's got three air defense out of the deal the defensive queen and the cc troops are taken care of goes ahead and sends in the remainder of his attacks got two lava hounds for this remaining air defense few balloons kind of on each of these outer defenses really nice patience on that second lava hound it goes in from that top section couple balloons on each of these defenses none of these target air other than an archer tower so just one per um the arch tower is locked onto that lava hound everything's moving in towards the expo and air defense chamber here too many balloons for this to handle that queen stepping up and helping out too um for these max attacks what i find is there's a very small window you have um to to get what you need to get out of your kill squad and then as well send in your balloons uh while they're still tanking from the golems while the ground troops are still in there doing work you want to have your air uh, air attack already started just so you can get a little bit of that tanking um for your balloons right like you look at these golem uh, golemites over here and they're tanking the arch tower tanking the um the tesla there uh, really keeping that queen protected. Queen's working on the town hall. He's got cleanup whiz all on the outside. So really nice execution on that, JJ. Uh, you didn't even really need that other lava hound. Um, yeah, I guess you weren't 100% sure if you were going to get all three of those air defense, but you sure did and wrecked this base like a boss. Nice three-star, buddy. Sexy. All right, let's flip down a few more here. What I have? Yeah, Ryan's hits on number six the hell i don't know why it's giving me problems today i do have something saving in the background that's my only thing i can i can think of um but ryan's gonna go ahead and bring a seven valk attack uh these bases are very very similar um you'll even see a couple of the replays that show they're similar bases walls are slightly different um but so ryan just reads this well uh drops his king just as a straight up king for queen swap also gets the CC lure at the same time. He's going to go ahead and drop that poison down. Take care of the CC troops and then start in with his air, um, the rest of his ground attack here. As soon as those balloons bite the dust, he's going to go ahead and drop his golems. One thing, I, one little critique I noticed when I watched this replay um, is he drops his funneling whiz too quickly. You'll see what happens here. The dragon's locked onto that golem, but it's so far away. He drops these whiz over here and it it retargets and goes right for these wizards and takes out his funneling whiz. They do get the army camp in time, so not a huge deal. Um, 
but that could really screw up your raid if that dragon for some reason did not come right back in here under the archer queen and get taken care of um, but how do you critique a three star looking good all his valves are now going in right towards that jump right towards that core they're gonna get huge value rage goes down watch the valves just two shot these defenses boom 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 and they jump right into the core gonna just take out that stuff heal goes down to help them out so their job is basically done because if you look there is no spots for bombs or anything in the top sections of this base and here come the giants do a little bit of tanking on these point defense is going to send in hogs kind of sprinkled in in an arc all around this 12 o'clock location basically from you know 10 to 2 just like you're driving hogs everywhere and they're just going to take out the remainder of these defenses because if you look the only thing that that ground army missed was these three defenses right there and he's got about 20 hogs going right towards it right now so just destroyed this base ryan really nice job this base can be done in so so many ways beautiful it's your three stars what else did i have i think i have eight no who do I want to show there? Nine? Yeah, dirty. Dirty, dirty. Bring in the Lalos. He actually did a hog attack for a three star in our uh, most current war. He was very nervous about it. <laughs> but it actually, the attack was <laughs> better off than his Lalo in, that, in the war. So maybe he's onto something. But DI brings his standard issues. Uh, shattered Lalo here. Um, you know, brings his funneling troops. Four ways, couple minions, two golems. 16 balloons with the three lava hounds for the back end two rages a jump uh two haste and a poison so looking pretty good on his entry here just needs to get that dark elixir storage down and he can send everything else in as soon as it's down boom he's going to send the king in right onto these breadcrumbs love when enemies seem to leave those uh storages in the exact right place for you for your breadcrumbs um I've really been really been recognizing spots where that where they leave those and you can clear a whole funnel and leave that one building up for all your units to lock onto. Poison went down, took care of those CC troops, no problem. Dragon's at half health. Queen's about to step up and finish them off. Down goes the dragon. Uh, really just needs to get this last air defense here because the defensive queen is down. Bam. Goes ahead and sends in his air attack. Huge spread on that first uh, Lava Hound. He just wants to send in a few balloons on each of these... Uh, outer outer defenses doesn't want the remaining screwing up his balloon pathing other lab hound goes in. he's going to continue to sprinkle these balloons all over the place haste is going to push these balloons right back into action here right on top of that sweeper few more loons going right at that uh, air defense he only has that one air defense remaining and seven more balloons in the bag here so rage goes down gonna just rock those seven eight loons right through the rest of that Boom, right on top of that last air defense, sends in the rest of his balloons, kind of just sprinkled in on the rest of these defenses on the bottom half. And there's not much left. A couple Archer Towers is the only things left to take out these balloons. Goes ahead and drops his um, two on that cannon, one on that mortar, just wants them all to go down at the same time. And it is clean up, bam, bam, and bam. Uh, something I've been noticing with my Lalos, at least, I always, like, always, 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 always have to force myself to save one balloon for cleanup. Once all defenses are down, you drop that balloon wherever you kind of need it, and it helps out a lot. Uh, Dirty kind of recognized he needed to drop a couple on those defenses because he had a good spread on his loons anyway. So nice job, Dirty. Sexy. Uh, one more. Generator. Our lovely Australian lady showing her best attack here, her Shattered Goho. She is the master of this Shattered Goho it blows me away almost every single base it's kind of how malfunction is with a shattered lalo uh jen is like that with shattered goho she can really just break down almost any base and throw 30 hogs at it and come away with the three star so uh, watch how she does it here goes ahead and creates this huge funnel what i really like was the two lone hogs in on this those archer towers while they got all that tanking um, basically got those two free defenses and as soon as that wall open the golems now can just walk right in right he's just uh, um, sorry she is just uh, making sure those golems really get that push up into that core uh, already sends in the hogs as well from the four o'clock position i love how she did that 
Um, just no no delay, right? That Archer Queen is still up there, but uh, the Arch Queen is locked onto those golems, so it doesn't really matter. The hogs are just going to kind of have free reign as they work their way up and around this base. Still has units going, you know. The king finally gets in there and is about to lock onto that defensive queen. Um, hit, uh, her queen is locked onto that lava hound. Uh, but look at all these hogs, right? There's still probably 25 some hogs in this little pack, if not more, maybe all 30. Finally loses a few to spring traps there, but there is one tiny section of base left, and it is healed looking good from this point jen just killing it with the shattered go hose i love it <clears throat> beautiful 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 lots of clean up around the base but it doesn't matter look at all those hogs i don't think you lost more than 10 hogs this whole raid at most sexy three star from our australian lady all right Looking good, guys. Uh, like I said, we, we don't like these small wars, but it has to happen sometimes when you when you got a whole bunch of people pulled in all different directions, filling war waves for other clans and for, you know, jumping down with Invicta and doing wars with them and things like that. So um, that's what happened there. Uh, we do have some really good content on the horizon. Uh, I know we have an arranged matchup coming this weekend, and it is against North Remembers. Yep. Yep. Uh, <laughs> Hopefully 2.0 can get a little bit of uh, revenge for Invicta because Invicta just had a war with them and definitely uh, definitely was a difficult war for Invicta. Uh, hopefully the 2.0 boys can really show them uh, show them what the 2.0 chain is all about. Uh, I know we've had a few wars with them in the past and they are fantastic. So hopefully this one is nothing short of that. Uh, I think I'm going to call it uh, an afternoon here though, guys. I got to go get ready for work. Uh, yeah, uh, my work week has begun again. I'm a chef too, so I I work very strange, strange hours, and uh, you know, like my days off, for example, are Monday, Tuesday. I'm sure that's not usual for for many people. So, anyhow, I am out of here. That does it for your wisdom from Wiser. Just trying to help you bag that next three star. And until then, I'm out.